This week on FIFA Football Mundial, we're in Lithuania with the kings of the domestic scene. FK Ekranas, once a factory side from Panavežiš, now six times champions of Lithuania. One man's had more to do with that rise than most. He's a former player, coach and director of sport, Virginius Liupsis. When you spend 20, 27 years with a club, it means a great deal. I was formed here as a player. As a player here, I became a champion. I won the Lithuanian Cup the Super Cup. From a player, I grew into a coach. As a coach, we also won everything we could in Lithuania and across the Baltics too. So the club will always remain in my heart as a, well, how do I put it, as the biggest achievement in my life. There have been very difficult periods. There have been periods when we didn't know what things would be like the following month, whether we would have funds to keep going. There were times when sponsors stopped supporting us, when even the main sponsor, Ekranas, stopped supporting us. But I think that the huge enthusiasm, the desire to keep the team going, has enabled it to survive. And certainly for many years, I think, Ekranas has been an example for other teams. Another former player, Valdas Abonas, has been in charge of the club since 2008. I understood what a challenge this was to me both as a human being and as a coach, because this team is famous in Lithuania. Of course, it could be said there was an initial lack of experience, but that's eclipsed by optimism and a desire to continue the club's good traditions. That's what I've been trying to do for the last few years. Football is the number one sport in Panavežis, and it's great that we have such fans. We have fans who support us all the time. Of course, we feel their support. Perhaps the fans have become used to our victories, and perhaps they want something more. They want a more beautiful game. They want more goals. But, realistically speaking, we're just trying to do our work. We know that we're part of the community of Panavežis and we're trying to do our work well. Four consecutive championships testify to the effect Urbanus has had on the team. Chasing a fifth straight crown this campaign, Ekranas have lost just twice all season. Comprehensive home victory over Dynava during our visit was simply routine for the Panavežis side, who lie a point clear of rivals Jalgiris Vilnius with one game left to play. I don't have any doubts about the team's capacity. I hope, I believe, that after the last match, we'll be standing at the very top of the table. Although, it is football. After spending eight years developing his experience in England, assistant coach Valdas Dabrauskas returned to Lithuania in 2010. At all times, plans are being made for the future. The members of the club are all responsible for the results. It's not the case of if we didn't win today or if we lost today, it's the sole responsibility of the head coach. I think that such teamwork is the reason Akranas has been champions for four years and, let's hope, will be for the fifth year as well. What makes Ikranis different? Without doubt, it's the spirit, which has remained the same for many years. And everything else, the infrastructure and so on. And, I don't know how to tell you, it's simply the spirit that hovers over the name Panavish Ikranis. It's a great joy to win something, not somewhere else, but in my native town, where people know me, where my family and friends are, and where they have the chance to watch me and my matches for their favourite team, a winning team. We're certainly a big club by Lithuanian standards. 
In terms of European standards, we are, comparatively speaking, a very small club. And we still need to progress a lot. Heavy defeats in Europe this season at the hands of Anderlecht and Stoja Bucharest show the size of the task still at hand. We work every day to reduce the gap. Sometimes you simply need great fortune to be lucky when it comes to certain matches so that we have our best ever game on the day we're playing in the Champions League. Perhaps not only the season's best game, best game in the entire history of the club. And, at the same time, the opposition has their worst game of the season, or even the decade. I think the day will come for Lithuania when some team will get somewhere. And I think, I hope, that will be happening sometime soon. I would really like to see it happen and feel what it means to take part in the Champions League. I'm glad the club has been flourishing, that it's been doing well. They've been playing well. They have excellent young players, good young coaches. Of course, maybe at some point in the future I'll link up with them again. I do live here in Panavejas, so perhaps I'll come back and work somewhere within the club. To start and finish here would be a kind of dream.